A big part of this goes back to the original owner, Dr. Burgess. He had a vision. And immediately when I came in, he shared that vision of what he wanted. And, and this is what he saw. But the first word that comes to me when I think about where's my dedication, where's my passion, and I think about AESC, and I think about the employees and the clients and the patients, I'm, I'm so proud. I'm so proud of who I get to work with and what they do. One of the unique things about AESC is the culture of the hospital is extremely positive. It's very professional and um, people take care of each other. I've been really impressed that in spite of all of the stress, we've still managed to keep a positive culture within our walls and take care of each other and have fun doing our, doing our work. And so I think that's really important when you're thinking about what type of emergency or specialty hospital you wanna to go to. I've been through my own personal medical issues and stuff and, and everybody's been right there to help me out, you know, through any kind of hard time and, and, and it makes me get attached. I don't know about other people, but you're willing to, to go above and beyond for me. Well, I'm willing to do that for you too. And it's not necessarily, I mean, the work environment's good too, but it's not necessarily that that is always like, I gotta stay. It's, it's the people, you know, I've, I've, become real close to you know a lot of these guys we have 10 values and that's a lot <laughs> um, you know they say in the structure of of doing your values you really should only have five but the fact is that when we put them together our mission our values this came directly from the hearts of the employees and who am I to say well we only can have five and so these five don't matter no I said these are all important we put them together, we defined them, and so no, we're gonna keep them. <laughs> In emergency medicine, I get to see and do everything. Uh, the mundane kind of gets thrown out the window really quick with what we do. Some of the things that I love best about our recent move from our older hospital to this hospital now, uh, well, it, there's almost too many to count, but some of the big ones, uh, number one, the facility is probably, I don't even know how many dozens of times larger. We have three surgical suites now rather than one. We have so much more equipment, so we're offering now more state-of-the-art surgical services. We also have room to grow in terms of getting more specialists. Instead of having one treatment table, we have probably six or eight. I don't even know how many. We have too many for me to count. If you want to just make it a small comparison, it's just the ability to move around and be able to do multiple things at once. What drew me to AEC specifically was the trajectory for growth that we have. And what I really like about the way that we've approached this as a hospital is there's no limit, there's nothing, there's no specific endpoint um, that we have in mind. We are going to continue to grow and serve the community, whatever that looks like. I mean, there's a lot of different positions available, a lot. There's positions for like everything. There's a lot of opportunity. Like I said, we do surgeries, CTs. I mean, there's all sorts of things to do with the animals. So if you start out here, they're gonna encourage you to learn more and you're gonna end up here eventually. As long as you keep plugging away and you're willing to put that effort in, you're gonna, you're gonna get there. In my personal instance, I have a, a baby boy and the, I'm personally most excited about raising him in an area that uh, all the things that I love to do and have at my disposal from whether it's going to the city or it's going to the mountains or fishing, crabbing, shrimping, all the things that we do on a regular basis. I'm glad that I have the ability to, to take him and share those things with him uh, and, and the things that he ends up finding in this area that he loves, even if I don't like him. <laughs> Do we have medical? Yes. Do we have dental available? Do we have long-term and short-term disability? We have uniform allowance. We have pet discount. We have support for training, 401k. All those things that are very, very important. But I would take it all back again to what's really important is feeling good at work, liking who you work with.
feeling supported, feeling appreciated. Everybody understands what's important and what's important is providing compassionate quality care to our patients and to our clients.